So here we have the Renault Capture on a 21 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you around the outside of the car and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside. From the outside though, you can see it's a five door car with alloy wheels and tinted windows. As we approach the back of the car, you can see we have reversing sensors. Plenty of boot space as well, along with that 60-40 split folding rear seat, should you wish to increase this space even further. Okay, so we're just going to work our way back around to the front of the car, and then we'll hop in and run through some controls on the inside of it from there. But now that we've done a full circle, you can see it's in excellent condition the whole way around. Just briefly before we climb in, I think it's well worth seeing the interior from this exterior point of view. There's plenty to run through on the dashboard, so let's hop in and we'll do that now. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter and coolant temperature gauge. On the right-hand side, the speedometer and fuel gauge. In the center, you can see the total miles for the car. They are 37,116. We have a digital readout for the speedometer just there as well. You can change that information using buttons on the steering wheel for various bits of trip computer info and other menus as well, all of which are accessed via the buttons on the right hand side of the steering wheel just here we have our phone controls there as well cruise control and speed limiter over on the left hand side and then into the center the main touch screen for the car so as you can see we have satellite navigation available on here we've done a video showing how this sat nav works which you can find on our website and on our youtube channel as well you can pair your phone of course and once you've done so you can make and receive phone calls obviously but you can also stream your music wirelessly via bluetooth audio as well as uh, listen to your music via the radio of course we've got two usb inputs and an auxiliary input as well so loads of ways to listen to your music in this car below that we can lock and unlock the car doors from the outside we've got a hazard warning lights we can put the car in eco mode we can also turn off the stop and start this car is designed to cut out when it's stationary in traffic which in turn will save you fuel that system is off when that light shows we have our climate control so you can adjust the temperature uh, the direction of the air uh, the fan speed over here air conditioning is on at the minute so that's off back on again or hit auto the car will now take control of the fan speed to maintain that temperature for you any manual adjustment will take auto off straight away again we can recirculate the air that's in the car that's a great way of heating it up or cooling it down quickly depending on the temperature you set here with a 12 volt charging socket auxiliary input and the two usb inputs i mentioned a moment ago the key for the car just need to make sure that's in here with you and then this button will start and stop the engine and then lastly we have the six speed manual gearbox all that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video if you'd like to come and see the car in person and have a test drive please feel free to give us a call here at mja car sales we'd love to hear from you soon